Hey folks, so I just wanted to give everybody an update on uh, that little barometric pressure data logger project. In this that, case, I'm actually using the BMP280, which just does uh, pressure and temperature. Hey folks, so I'm out here on the uh, uh, side of a wonderful rare wetland that's being hosted by the, uh, by the Nature Conservancy. And here's that little barrel logger that we put together with the uh, BMP280, uh, recording data on a little Adafruit Ada logger. So you can see here that um, it's strapped to this oak tree, which is located in the shade. And one of the nice things about having this massive solar panel in Arizona is that even in the shade, we're probably going to generate enough power off that um, off that solar panel to keep the charge on that uh, lipo battery um, topped off. And you can see that I've got a green light on the uh, solar lipo charger, so that's positive. That means that even in the shade of this oak tree in the summertime, I'm still generating uh, some uh, some power to top off that lipo battery. The other nice thing about this huge solar panel is that it's providing some shade and protection for the box from UV radiation. This is currently programmed to uh, record one data point every 15 minutes, uh, temperature and barometric pressure off the BMP280. And again, the reason we're playing with Arduinos, data loggers, and pressure sensors is we need local atmospheric pressure to help us calibrate data being collected by these pressure transducers in local wells, which will help us understand how wetland water levels are changing in response to climate change and upstream restoration projects. Finally, just a quick update on my next video where I hope to summarize the results of using five different data logger sensor combinations, which successfully collected data over the course of one month on a one minute interval. I'll go over the different architectures and lessons learned, and as always, I'll provide copies of my code for your review and personal use. Check out this old hand pump well, probably from turn of the century. How cool is that? Subscribe for updates and thanks for watching.